So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to stand properly for our drama lesson, which is feet apart and hands at your side. Okay? And the second thing we are going to do is just take a few deep breaths. In through your nose, out through your mouth for me. And in. And out. And in. And out. Last time, in, and out. And now that we are calm, focused, and ready. So, we are going to do our new version of snaking. Obviously, because of the new social distancing, we cannot all stand squishy squashy here. Am I right? Because we'd all be squishy squashy and there would be zero social distancing. So we've got a new version of snakey. Starts the same as any other. Let's put our hands together. Either together like this or together like this. Whichever you are more comfortable with. Right? We take a deep breath in. And we go on the spot. And turn. And then the next section of snake is quite easy. I would like you to go and then I'm going to tell you which direction to go in. So it's three. Right, you ready? So let's get those hands together. And I'll go side. Uh, the side. And up. And down. Turn around. One, two, three. Okay. Ready to do it again? Yes. Okay. And side. Other side. And up. And down. Turn around. And side. Other side. And up. And down, turn around, and side, other side, and up, and down, turn around, right, and then we back. So that's our new version of Slaky. So we start off by breathing, we then do our longs and our shorts. Right. Let's take another deep breath in, and out, and in, and out, and in, and out. Right, great boys, you've been away for a really long time, and you've been sitting behind the desk for almost two weeks now. So, let's just get a wiggle jiggle in. Wiggle it all out. Right. And we're ready to stop. Let's sit down. Yep. Thank you very much. Okay. So you may have watched a video or two. Right? You may have seen something that I asked you to do. But we're starting fresh. We're starting brand new. Although our concept is the same. Right? The first thing we're going to be looking at is a type of acting where we don't speak. We can remember what it's called. Okay, I think you all know. Can you tell me one, two, three? Mining. That's right, it's called mind or mining. So, when we act but we don't speak, two things become very important because we don't have a voice to tell our story. What tells the story for us? Who can remember? Ooh, yes. Your? Your movement, your body movements, okay? The body movements tell the story. They tell you where to go, what to do. They tell you everything you need to know. Your gestures, your body movements. 
And the second thing that is very important, who can remember? What is it? No, it's not angles. What else tells our story, Sadie? Your facial expressions become very important, okay? Now, you can see your facial expressions in your eyes. Did you know that? When you smile, and your smile is real, we can see it in your eyes. Yep. Your eyes actually turn a little bit upwards. And when you sad, your eyelids droop. And when you're angry, you've got big eyes. Okay, just like you can show. Okay, so your facial expressions tell the story. They tell us how you're feeling. They tell us what's happening in the story. Now there's something we need to learn, great pause, that is very important for mine. And that is when we pick up an object. Yes, an object. So, next to you is your table. Right? On your table is a glass of water. Pick it up. You're not picking it up like this, because what happens to our water? It spills. It spills, that's right. So, we hold our glass upright. Okay, you can put your glass down. There is a rock on your table. Turn around. Pick it up. Okay, it's heavy. You show me the heaviness in your face, in your body. Right? Okay, put it down. There we go. On our table is a feather. Light. So the weight of your object becomes very important. Do you see what I'm getting at here? Your object, how heavy or how light it is, you've got to show it with your body. You can't say, I'm going to pick up this big rock. Because <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't make sense, grade fours. Okay, you're with me so far. So our object weighting becomes important. Our facial expressions and our body movement. Right. Now, for today, I want you to think, think, think. I want you to think, think, think of a character. A mind character. Okay? A mind character who might pick something up. A mind character who might do something exciting. It can be any character at all, right? The thing is, you are going to have to act it out on your own. So you, by yourself, now, are going to come up with a little scene for me, okay? I want you to think, think, think. What can I be to act out on my own? What can I do on my own that I don't need a partner for? What story can I tell using my own face, my own body? Okay? It's got to be about you. Okay? So we think, think, thinking. We're coming up with a scene and then later we will be acting it out. Right. So I want to see you think, think, thinking.